Yeah, day is 17th, excuse me, 16th of uh, February, Thursday. Got a little problem with my deucing. This is the shifter. It's an automatic. You got forward, neutral, and reverse. I put it in gear, usually in forward, and it would stop, and I'd get an alarm on the dash showing that it was in neutral. Well, it's real easy to troubleshoot. The switch, uh, the contactors inside the switch are going bad, and it's hermetically sealed. There is no repair in it. You just replace it. So I got a call in to Deucin or ASGO equipment over in Tyler, Texas, to get a replacement for it. And then uh, the cover, it's a little clamshell cover for the steering column. That corner was broken. And I said, well, what the hell? And it's been opened up before and somebody put in a regular bolt and you can't get a socket or any type of wrench in there to it. I don't know how they got it in there. And it's supposed to have a bolt like this with a hex head on it. So I asked them to locate me another bolt. If they can't, I can cut a slot in that standard bolt for a flat tip screwdriver when I put it all back together. <clears throat> just enough to be irritating, ain't no big deal. It's just a little bit irritating. And I just noticed this is broken. I don't remember seeing that. But anyway, stuff breaks, ain't no big deal. It's all fixable. I'm not gonna change this cover out. I don't know how that got broke. Uh, I can figure out something on that real simple. And when I was cleaning up outside, after getting all my wood scrap hauled off to the dump, I found what probably a source of a leak on the wall. Glad I found it. There might be some wind noise here. close as I can and try to block it. Same thing I've been finding all over the building down here at the bottom, some corrosion. And uh, we know what the fix is. Uh, go back with some fiberglass and fix it. So I get the next batch of fiberglass mixed up and start fiberglass and stuff. I'll take care of this area too. in this corner here. Hope so. And, uh, boys up the hill hauling off another machine. It's a, big it's a thing to bend sheet metal. Uh, hey, it's their stuff. But something I learned over the decades, everything has value other than scrap. You just gotta find buyer. But that takes effort. So I don't think they found a buyer, but they want this stuff gone, I guess. I had no place to put it. I didn't even ask about it. Don't want it. So interesting. They called with another minor problem, no big deal. I told them what to do to fix it. They don't really need me, but we'll see. Anyway, that's all for this one. Thank you.